F my throat with that BWC, daddy. <laughs> this appears to be another man. <laughs> Poppy, oh, I swear my kids will be pleased. I would swallow the S out of your fingers. Oh God, please, I hate being a virgin. I'll never forget whenever I was younger, less attractive and less successful. I was the simp in all the girls' DMs, trying to get their attention. Oh, you look so cute. Can we go out on a date? All this crap. Oh, damn. Okay. Excuse me, can I touch you for a minute? <laughs> Excuse me, can I touch you for a minute? Now, the tables have turned. Girls are the ones DMing me, and I'm leaving them undelivered because I truly don't care. They're really not worth the energy most of the time. You guys read the title. Today, I will be showing you my DMs, not just from girls, some gay guys as well. Make things a little spicier. And before all the haters come at me in the comments, like, oh, oh, it's so egotistical, it's so narcissistic. <laughs> Let me tell you something, man. If I'm on here giving advice, telling young men how to look more attractive, how to be more confident, but I'm some loser on the internet, no girls care about me, when I'm out in public, no one cares about me, what advice can I even give you guys? Because obviously I'm not succeeding in what I'm doing. You guys all cope in the comments section, but man, I'm just proving a point. Now, even if you are a Chad, you're very handsome, you're very good looking, but you do not have your Instagram set up, you are still setting yourself up for failure because your Instagram, I tell you guys, it's your resume to life if you don't have it set up properly you will not become that guy even if you are that guy i'm telling you guys we're living in a black mirror episode people only care about your instagram how it looks and the photos that you're posting without further ado let's get into my dms just within the past four weeks let's get it <laughs> Most girls do not reach out in the DMs. This is actually probably like 1% of girls. Most girls, they do that thing where they either spam you with likes to get your attention or they just like two or three pictures so that you can do it back and then she might do it another time so that you could be the one to DM her. They are always trying to bait you to be the one to DM them. But if you're able to turn those tables, you automatically have power in this situation and this potential DMing than she does. One observation I've noticed is that most of the girls who DM me, they actually don't even follow me, man, because I'm not out here following random girls. So they don't wanna have that fear of rejection to where if they follow me, I won't follow back. And it's also a little bit of an ego thing. They don't want to admit that they wanna follow me and slide in my DMs. They would rather just slide into the DMs. We have a couple rules before we get into it. Number one, no hating on these women in my comments. Let's keep everything respectful. Also today, I'm only showing DMs from people who do not follow me because I think it's disrespectful to my followers to be sharing private messages that they're trying to reach out to me on the internet. That's a little bit rude, but if you're not following me, I really don't care so much. All of these screenshots are within the past four weeks. And by the way, the type of content that you're posting and uploading will also dictate the type of people who are going to be DMing you. Because if you put yourself out there as just more of a dorky guy, like you have these really niche things, you're probably gonna get a lot different girls than the types who have been messaging me. Cause I post a little bit cringy, narcissistic content because it does pretty well in the algorithm. Fun. This one is just a gay account. He just said, hey, nothing else. Girl DMs me saying, that she saw me at MBK. This is a huge shopping center in Bangkok, Thailand. I did not see her, but apparently she sees me. This girl wants to know if I am single. Is anybody available to chat? Now, whenever you DM somebody, I don't know if I set my profile up like this, but it just has a couple basic questions that you can DM them. She obviously just selected one, didn't put enough effort to actually type something out. Call me someday if you want to visit Moscow. This girl looks underage, she looks 15, something like that. I think it's a bit strange DMing full grown men. This girl just said hi, nothing else. Meow. And then she responded to my food pick, just saying yum. A little bit of a double sex there. Trying to get my attention. Are you on Snapchat or just Instagram? Now, I think as a full grown man, I don't think anybody out there should be having Snapchat in 2024, but some girls are still gonna ask you if you have Snapchat to talk to them. Maybe because they wanna see if you're a catfish or just so they can get some more attention out of you. I never actually advocate to guys to download Snapchat and Snapchat these girls. Always just try to secure the date first because next thing you know, you'll be getting streaks and just snapping back and forth while she's doing this to 10, 20, 30 other guys just getting all that attention. 
I loved your backpack. A lot of girls will try to DM you just to give you a basic compliment. Sometimes it's not even about looks, just so that you can respond to it. You guys will notice a lot of girls, they'll just say random stuff that doesn't even make sense just to get a response out of you. Like I'll have girls literally ask the most random questions to things that don't even make sense. And it's because they want me to respond back like, oh, why, what does that mean? Lindo baby, this is a South American woman. Lindo means handsome in Spanish. Uh, I kind of blew up a little bit in South America. So there's a lot of like Brazilians and Mexicans on my page now. Marry me now, just a perfect man. Pretty, and then she messages again. When should I visit Japan, winter or summer? It looks like I see a child on there. So my guys, uh, try to avoid single mothers best you can out there, just a word of advice. I'm going to need you to come to Georgia. Okay, thanks. Georgia is actually a country in Eastern Europe. I'm not sure if a lot of you guys know that. A lot of people think it's a state. Seems kind of like a red flag, but whatever, man. Heart eyes, black heart, heart eyes. Ah, I can only send one message and there might be thousands of people. Will you notice me? Hey, bunny, I'm your super big fan and I can't send a message again. Heartbreak, crying, see me. I can use this color as a highlight. Heartbreak, red light, red light, red light. <laughs> You should cosplay Nanami. People will probably lose their marbles. I've been getting a lot of cosplay requests recently. If you guys want to see me actually cosplay someone, comment below. I'll be in America in a couple months so I can actually get some like proper equipment or maybe I can find some stuff in Japan. I don't know. Uh, buddy, responding to my caviar photo. If you have not had caviar, you should. That stuff is fire, man. Gosh darn, nice jaw. Gotta work on those jaw lines, guys. This girl just sent a smiley face, but it's more of like an analog smiley face. She's got like 1.1 million views. So kind of back to the first girl, some of these girls just have big egos, but they'll still reach out, but they won't even say anything. They just want to say one thing to get your attention and then expect you to chase them. You are super tall. She appears to be a lady boy, no hate, but it is what it is. And girls seem to like tall guys a lot but just remember that they will only like you just because you're tall you want to find a girl who actually likes you for deeper things than that will you marry me please and then be my man this girl says that she needs me she needs me what does she need i've been getting a lot of responses like this because of my height honestly i've been posting a lot of my height on my social media and these girls see it so they dm me but one thing you guys might not know is that height growth is only 60 to 80 percent genetic 20 to 40 percent environmental meaning that you can control it and with both my parents being roughly 5'8, 5'9, both me and my brother were able to optimize our heights to be like 6'4, 6'5 for my brother and obviously i'm six foot six so you can do a lot of optimization but you do need to be a little bit obsessed with it i believe the number one reason most people don't their high growth potentials because nutrient deficiencies 92 percent of americans across all social classes are deficient in basic vitamins and minerals it's actually going to shut down igf1 human growth hormone closing those growth plates so you need to pick up titan growth 2.0 on my website kaylacy.com which has 500 to 1000 percent of all your daily required nutrients to optimize your high growth don't forget you got to schedule a free one-on-one -on -one consultation with me man i'm just now accepting new clients for my one-on-one -on -one coaching i will help you build your dream physique look like a greek god male model i will help with your looks maxing journey freaking everything from a certified trainer and professional male model link in the description box or kalosleek.com slash pages slash coaching don't forget to join kalos vip this is my school of looks maxing with my three hour looks maxing master class two hour high growth master class right now i've got the female nature master class every two weeks we hop on a vip group call it is the best school of self-improvement you gotta join now link in the description what's it like to be perfect you are hot. I want to sit on your face. I'm pretty sure it'd be the other way around, but whatever. Can you help me get shredded? That's another one of my generic questions in the DMs. Never respond to someone who DMs you with one of the generic questions. I think it's kind of rude, man. At least come up with an original DM. We have another gay man in the DMs. Hi, tall fella. Damn, you feisty and fiery. He is a chef, as it appears. F my throat with that BWC, daddy. <laughs> This appears to be another man. <laughs> I have a huge crush on you. Meow. Poppy. Oh, I swear my kids will be pleased. I would swallow the S out of your fingers. Oh, God, please. I hate being a virgin. Does not sound like a virgin talking like that. Marry me. LOL. You are so hot and cute. Can I kiss you? 
And it's another man, once again. <laughs> Please date me. Please date me. Okay, you are eye candy for my eyes. If I'm eye candy, why doesn't she follow me? I am crying. I'm not exactly sure why she would be crying, but I think it's because she's saying I'm attractive. I don't know. I wanna lick your boobs. I'm sure it's a man, but yeah, another one. <laughs> this girl just responded to my story crazy, then her mind is blown and she's laughing. This is for your house. A whole bunch of emojis to me holding flowers. And then, I didn't know you had a girlfriend. What are your intentions with me? This girl's actually funny. Like, she posted a whole bunch of photos of me and like she was making it seem like she's in a relationship with me. And like she found out I was in a relationship and then she like started posting all about it, acting like I cheated on her. I'm like, dude, we have never spoken once. It's hilarious, man. My ceilings are higher in my house. You can come over, just a suggestion. I posted this video of me in Japan showering and my head was hitting the ceiling and everyone was saying to go shower in their place. So that's what she's referring to. I'm not going to pretend that I didn't see that you liked my comment. I like everyone's comment on Instagram, unless it's hate. Come to Jakarta with me in two days. We have not spoken once. She wants me to travel with her. That's crazy. This one is in Spanish, but I translated it. Hi, love. I want to be yours. I always wanted a blonde boyfriend. He has to be blonde. Little snack with the cherry emojis. I thought cherries meant like... I didn't know that could be used for men. All she said was, oh, wow. Just, oh, wow to my... Profile, I guess. You know what would look good with a 198 centimeter, a 174 centimeter? Probably you're way younger though. Keep up with the good modeling. I can give you a child. This woman wants to bear my child. Hi Austin, I just moved here. It's kind of embarrassing TBH. That's why I message you on a fake account, but I'm looking for someone to make content with. Send me a reply if you're interested with. Kind of sounds like a scam, but I'll let you guys decide in the comments. You make me so wet, OMG. Is anyone available to chat? Has anyone ever told you that you look just like my future boyfriend? <laughs> Private accounts, by the way, you can't see that feed, so it's just the one photo. Hello, I'm from Chile. You seem like the perfect combination for a model for a brand like Gucci, Dior, Polo, or a model. Entertainer, you are young, prepare for it. It would be great because not only would you earn a lot of money, but you would also be happy. A hug. I hope you come to South America. Never forget that no matter what others say, it is always how you feel that comes first, as long as you do no harm. That's a nice message, but... Yeah, cuz you're hot lol. Now this was actually in response to my story where someone was catfishing pretending to be me on a dating app I posted about it. So that was the response. Hey smiley face. Hey smiley face is always a basic opener for a lot of girls I think most of you guys should respond if a girl says that to you if you like her obviously you cute meow <laughs> Those are funny. Yeah, that's like the third one. I think I want you so bad help. She is Russian I believe I wanted to be nonchalant and not DM you, but that wouldn't work because then you never know that I exist. So I had to stop and DM you. I'm highly autistic, but no way. 5'3", completely autistic. It's funny. I like your energy and style, by the way. Haha, <laughs> cutie. I've noticed transformations. A lot of girls seem to respond to those, but I don't know, man. I never think that old me looks cute, but it seems to work. Normally, I don't write to men. I like, but this is the first time I see you and I literally want to shout at you that you should come to Turkey and kidnap me. She wants me to kidnap her. Sounds a little illegal. Are you into trans girls? But yeah, I posted a meme and it got a lot of trans girls on the page. Nothing against it. Love everybody. Come get me, wet. Last chance to fly to Australia to meet me. It's my last chance. Let me fuck you already. <laughs> hey, how much do you work out? Once again, a lot of girls will ask irrelevant questions just to have a conversation with you and not think that they're trying to slide into your DMs, which they still are. Jesus and G's to two separate stories. The shirtless gym photos are always very successful. Hey yo, I saw your videos, 6'6 six, six in Thailand and so on. I'm 6'3 as a young woman and everyone is also giving me a side eye, haha. -ha. Are you up for going in public together? For example, go through a market. The faces of the Asians will be fun, hee <laughs> hee. This one actually seems innocent, so I'm not gonna say this is a thirsty DM, just a, a DM. Hi handsome, give me a drawer that doesn't close, I beg you. I don't even know what this means. If anyone knows what this means, let me know in the comments. This is translated from Spanish. Hi, I just came across your account and honestly, I was swiping away until I saw this reel. I think this concept of love is somehow missing nowadays. So it is very kind of you to spread this message, especially being a model. You know, appearance is surely important, but not enough. 
and it could set standards making it difficult to really fall in love. So yeah, I wish you good luck in finding your other half, assuming you really believe in that real. The real is about like real love and stuff. Actually, I don't know why am I writing this to you. Haha, ha, I felt like doing it. Also, if you ever happen to be in Italy, let's grab a coffee. I'd like to know how you're living in Japan is. Have a good day. Bro, just let me fly you to England so I can suck that D and give you the best head ever. Hey, super random, but I will be in Thailand from January 20th to 7th of March. Would love to connect if you're around then. All the best. Why do you not have a single hair strand? Now this kind of sounds like hate. Like I said, a lot of girls will try to hate you in the DMs just to shit test you. And the key is to never get defensive or offended by it. Have you ever tried pee pee mogging? Bro, you gotta try it out. It's the ultimate hack when it comes to maxing, LMAO. Now, I always think it's funny when guys try to DM me, hate on me, and then I look at their profile and then just see how they look. They usually don't look like they're killing it too much. All right, guys, so there is a lot more DMs that I could read, but I'm already in 30 minutes raw time just talking all this out, and I still have to edit it all, so I don't want this video to be too long, but that's it, man. Subscribe if you're new. Hope you got some entertainment out of this, and I love you with all my heart. Peace.